right. And here's a look at some of those hot spots based on that data from the wastewater samples. Northwest Houston, Third Ward, Southeast Houston and Sharpstown are some of the areas they're focusing on. The city's health department can get a lot of data from wastewater. It trends and we can see whether the, the amount of virus in the waste is increasing or decreasing. The city has been collecting weekly wastewater samples from 39 water treatment plants for more than a year now. They started back in May of 2020. The city's health department and Rice University are analyzing the data. What we can do is we can compare like this area of town is higher than this area of town. Um, that tells us where virus is changing or, you know, increasing or areas we need to focus on for intervention. And in those cases where more virus is detected, they can go one step further and hone in on specific facilities like schools and nursing homes by accessing samples from manholes. We report that information back to the facility so they know that someone in the building um, is shedding the virus. Not surprisingly, the city has seen a huge spike in the virus due to the Delta variant. For perspective, if you compare the peak that we saw in July of last summer to the peak we're seeing now, it's 300% higher today than it was back then. The good news is it is starting to drop off a bit. It is going down and we're really thankful it's going down, but again, lots of virus out there. Time to get vaccinated. Marla Carter, ABC 13 Eyewitness News.